And here we are, folks, guys. How awesome is this? Editor mode, Minecraft Bedrock, for the win! Hey there, guys, Skippy here. For Rome! Skippy6 Gaming, guys, coming to you from editor mode. This is Minecraft Bedrock editor mode. It's not the easiest to just get here. Uh, you have to do a few jumps and loops, but we got this today. Uh, there was a leak last week as well. How exciting is this, guys? Consider subscribing to my channel if you like this sort of Minecraft news and information. And yeah, so basically, guys, today, J Megaspot tweeted out this guy right here. Yeah, bingo bango. We're all kind of excited. We're like, okay, new editor mode. We started making the video and then we realized it's a really big thing. It's a whole nother mode of the game ready to go here. So uh, I'm going to start right from the beginning. I don't even know a lot of these people. I guess they're people that have been, you know, working on this uh, feature for a little bit of time. And uh, yeah, so this link right here from this tweet will link you to the how to install this game. So uh, basically, you need to have Minecraft, uh, you need to have Minecraft preview in order to do this. You can't do this on Android, uh, and you need to have a keyboard. So it only works on Windows Edition, which I just so happen to be playing right now. Windows Preview Edition at the moment. And yeah, so basically, I'm going to jump over. I'm going to jump over, and we're just going to go over it together. The link here. I will put this link in the description below as well. And yeah, and that brings us right here, guys. So uh, yeah, we got this guy right here. It's basically telling you how to get the Minecraft editor. Uh, it's a little more complicated than you would think. Uh, we're just going to go through. I'm going to scroll down and use this to explain. Uh, and then there's also a tutorial here. Again, all these links are, are given to you in the description. So basically, make sure uh, you install Minecraft Preview if you do not have it already, which we are currently playing on this PC at least. Uh, download and install it. Again, I use the launcher just exactly like this one for Java Edition and everything. Uh, and then we're going to follow this one here. Guys, you're going to right click anywhere on your desktop, uh, get a drop down, make a new shortcut. Uh, once you get there, what you're going to do is uh, go ahead and, and put this in. Uh, Minecraft, uh, I'm not even going to try to say the word, just follow this code right here or again the link. Uh, and once you do this and click next, you're going to see this little box on your desktop uh, and or wherever you save items for me it's desktop. But yeah, for you, anywhere you out and then bang, when you double click this, it's going to say, how do you want to launch this? Uh, you're going to say uh, that you want to launch it in Minecraft uh, preview. And yeah, so there's a lot of shortcuts. Like I said, guys, links are here if you need them. Uh, that's simple enough. Uh, everything here again, there's a whole a whole long article basically trying to you know tutorial you on this bad boy uh, but when you go through all of this you're gonna end up and that brings us right here guys as you can see uh, for the first time this just came out like an hour ago uh, introduction movement we have kind of a menu here looks a little uh, uh, structure blockish and yeah so welcome to Minecraft editor it's a multi-block editing experience uh, that helps you easily craft high quality worlds in Minecraft bedrock uh, they're working on this development and yeah, so basically the first one here, let's see, movement, hold down your right mouse button and viewpoint. So the right mouse button being held down is going to do like a kind of drag, you know, and the same controls as any video game, uh, left, right, up, down. Uh, let's go selection, left click anywhere in the world to select a single block or use the gizmo and hold shift between left clicks to place opposite corners. Okay, so we look good. Tools, select a brush from the left tool rail. They're up here on the side. Uh, left click and drag to paint actions. Uh, there's a whole bunch of uh, selections here again guys There's a whole entire uh, a whole entire instruction manual for you to read uh, should you desire uh, But yeah, so crosshair mode we're in crosshair mode uh, escape or control tab more so I'm here escape will always just bring us out uh, and then Go into this crosshair mode again. Okay, so if you ever want to get out Forget, we can left tap, you single click. So you're in kind of like a spectator. Pretty interesting. Uh, yeah. So let's do this. Let's go ahead and paste. So basically we got our good old fashioned cut and paste. Uh, let's do this. Brush, stone, hollow. So I should be able to, uh, oh, there we go. We're already doing it. So I think you can drag. Okay. So basically when you go into this mode, so you go into crosshair mode until you want to do something and then you move to the exact location where you can reach it from basically. And then you go into there 
and then you pick what you want to do uh, you want to do this you want to do this you want to do your brush mode okay so now look bang so now they're putting this big brick of stone so the brush size is nine uh so what's happening here is it's doing a nine by nine is that what that is it's a nine nine wide i wonder if it goes deeper in yeah it is so it's a nine by nine square so that's what that brush does basically uh so yeah i guess that means that if we do a brush size that's like uh three then i'm betting we're gonna have a three on here Oh, so you have to leave crosshair mode like this. Go to the brush size. Okay, we got the brush size and bango. And it puts a three by three, exactly like you said. Uh, there's several other options. So I guess redo or undo and redo. Okay, that's really cool. Let's look up here. So there's a whole bunch of control ones just to copy, paste, different selections. Again, guys, there's a whole user manual. Uh, I think I'm probably going to go in depth to it and maybe, you know, see if I can't put together a tutorial in the next like few days. And we can even extend things all over the world. <laughs> That's pretty crazy. Going over here. So as soon as you get out of this, you can literally spread. So if your brush is five, but if your brush is one or two, watch this this you could draw a little circle bang you could even draw like question marks in the world i guess if you wanted to i guess i could do it from up in the sky this would be super cool let's try it so it looks like i'm too far away oh no i'm not oh very 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 cool guys very cool uh options actors pause actors they pretty much only have these few options ready to go this time around, but you know what? I think it's super cool, guys. Um, yeah, don't forget to smash that like. Don't forget to uh, subscribe to my channel because, yeah, we're going to be doing some uh, editor tutorials. I'm almost certain about that. And, uh, yeah, catch you on the next one.